if Brett's telling the truth, okay, he will tell you that in the kitchen prior to beginning the show today, I engaged him in a conversation about trade, didn't I, Brett? And spatchcocking, which, uh, you know, set him upon, uh, you know, like a, a whirlwind of ideas. Uh, he did not know what it was. And then I downshifted into Smoot Hawley. And if he's to tell the truth, that is exactly what I brought up. Now, you know, Jahari, what the result of the 1930 Smoot Hawley Tariff Act was? Had many yeah. results, all of them piss poor. Uh, it actually reduced the number and the amount of trade that the United States was doing with other countries, and it led to the Great Depression. That's number one. But number two, it led to Adolf Hitler. How? Yes. Yes, it did. Because in Germany, where they were recovering from World War I, part of Smoot Hawley was pay your war debt. And they printed yeah. money to pay their war debt. It's just like Trump running around about NATO, NATO. They have to pay their own share or we're not defending them. Same exact MO. Fascists only know a couple of tricks, and this is one of them. And uh, Germany, uh, you know, during the Hindenburg uh, era, decided that he was going to print money and pay the debt. And that's what led uh -huh. to hyperinflation, and that's what led to the rise of the elected Adolf Hitler. Don't have time to listen to the live show? Want to hear more on your schedule? Go to randyroads.com and buy a stinking podcast.